YouTubers, this is with the Hot Emmet and in this video I'm going to show you how you can resize or compress the image uh, using a tool called Custom Photo Resizer. Uh, it is available on the internet for the free for free. Uh, I have given the link in the description. You can just go there and download it and after that uh, you have to install it and uh, after installation you'll see uh, I'll, I'm going to show you how you can uh, do the resizing or compression system. So here is an example image. Uh, it is uh, uh, 1.16 MB size image and its dimensions are 500 to 88 by 3600 which are pretty large. So I'm going to show you how you can uh, compress it. So first of all open the uh, Photo Resize, on Photo Resizer, and you know, browse to your desktop or where your image is located. In, in my case, it's on desktop. So I have selected desktop and click OK. So here is the image. Uh, I have selected it and click on Add. And if you have more than one image, you can select them just by dragging your mouse on them and you can click Add or if you want to add all of these images like if there is there are lots of images or in the same folder uh, you just click on add all or also like I have added this image and we can remove it or clear it by using these buttons so I have selected JPEG and uh, select the output folder from the browse and I'm gonna create a folder on the desktop for image and then use advanced options just tick mark it and click on option advanced options and you can resize image in this tab if you click on resize you can change the dimensions of this image in pixels in percentage and whatever you want and there are lots of options in here uh, you can Pick standard sizes from here. You can rotate the image. You can crop it. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna resize the image, but I'm gonna compress it. Also, you can crop it. Uh, you can change the color depth, um, adjustments, brightness. There are lots of options in here. Uh, you can also add watermarks on your image. So you can just select watermark from your folder. And you can also add border or border effects from here. I'm not gonna do all these things because uh, I'm only interested in uh, compressing the image. So I'm gonna click on settings, and here you can select the quality of the image, which is which will be outputted, how which you want to be, and output. So I have set it on to 90. Uh, so it will what it will do is uh, it will shrink. Uh, shrink your image uh, you will not see much difference in this pixel if you um, keep this down then you uh, probably notice the uh, pixels but for in my case uh, I will suggest you keep it on 80 to 90 which is good and also uh, it says color subsampling high small file size or disable so better quality but Fast size will be more okay. Just tick these uh, two options and click on OK. And then there are more options you can rename it, you can keep the original date and time attribute and ask before override. So if you know, there is already image out there, uh, you, it will ask you to override it uh, or not. So I'm just gonna click on convert and, and here we go. So it, it compressed the image, so the old size of the image is 1.19 1 MB and now new size is 900 MB. It's uh, like it compressed it uh, really uh, low in low ratio like 20, 19%. It compressed it in like 19%, so not too much. So it, it depends on the quality. If you reduce the quality to like 50%, you can convert it. So it will ask you to um, override it. So I'm gonna say yes, and now you can see 36 percent. So it depends on images. It, this image is already compressed enough, so it is it, it is really hard to compress this image. But um, you will you will notice it, it can only it can 
be your best like 80 to 90 percent you can save 80 to 90 percent of your um, size without uh, damaging image uh, quality so if I go to my image um, just wait for it so as you can see um, there is no quality uh, quality damage in this image but the size of the image is reduced to um, 426kp like from 1 MB to uh, 426kp is it's good so thank you guys for watching if you have any questions please feel free to ask and don't forget to subscribe